The former Sunday League footballer will be part of an all-male dance partnership for Strictly Come Dancing 2022 which will air on BBC One later this year. Richie said he cannot wait to get in those sparkles but admitted he will have to cancel his legendary launch night party. Richie said in a statement, This is a dream come true. I cannot wait to get in those sparkles and sequins and shimmy across the most famous dance floor in the world. Strictly is the ultimate feel-good show, as soon as I hear that iconic theme tune it's just pure escapism. I'm going to have to cancel my legendary Strictly launch night kitchen party that I throw every year, I'm sure my friends and family will understand. It's also a massive honor to be part of an all-male dance partnership, it's so important we have that inclusion on such a huge show. John Barnes slams calls to scrap taking the knee Richie is best known for his role on BBC Radio 2's breakfast show where he presents the travel bulletins. In May he travelled to Turin, in Italy, to cover the Eurovision Song Contest for the radio station. He also appears as a presenter on The One Show and was recently proud to be part of the BBC's Platinum Jubilee coverage. His Strictly Come Dancing announcement was revealed on Friday's installment of the BBC Radio 2 Breakfast Show. Presenter Kim Marsh and actor Will Miller were announced as Strictly Come Dancing contestants on Thursday. Former Coronation Street star Kim said, I've considered doing Strictly for years but the timings never worked out. I'm so delighted that this year they have. I'm a huge fan of the show and can't believe I'm going to go from watching at home in my pajamas to actually dancing in front of the judges in a glittery dress, it's unreal. Two pints of lager and a packet of crisps star will opened up on BBC Breakfast about his decision to sign up for the show. When does Strictly Come Dancing 2022 start? Explainer Strictly Come Dancing 2022 lineup, celebrity contestants confirmed, inside Strictly's Kimberly Walsh back Santon Dubeka after judge exit, latest, he said, my mum's, had such a tough time, she lost my dad, I wanted to give her something to look forward to. She lost my dad and her brother and brother-in-law and sister in a year, in 2020, through Covid. It was a really tough time for the family and we wanted to get on this Strictly train together and add a bit of positivity as she can come down to the show. He later said, so there are a few reasons why I am doing it, and I just think mentally it will be good for me to have something to focus on. Filming for the 20th series begins on September 7, with a pre-recorded launch show. Although it has not been confirmed by the BBC, the launch is expected to air in the middle of September. The professional dancers and contestants are set to return to Blackpool's Tower Ballroom this year following a two-year hiatus caused by the coronavirus. Strictly Come Dancing 2022 will be broadcast on BBC One at a date yet to be officially announced.